Okay, guys, here is the list of the clean 15 foods of 2024, according to the EWG's analysis of the F most recent FDA reports on um, the least amount of pesticides on your fruits and veggies. So use this just as a guideline if you can't get to the local um, farmer's market. Okay, so topping the list is avocados, then comes pineapple or sweet corn, go for the organic to avoid the GMOs, onions, papaya, frozen sweet peas, asparagus, honeydew melon, kiwi, cabbage, mushroom, mangoes, sweet potatoes, watermelon, and carrots. Now, some of the fruits and veggies that neither hit the dirty dozen or the clean 15 are tomatoes, cherry tomatoes, potatoes, broccoli, and cauliflower. And if you want the full list of them, you can go ahead and I'll put a link down in the description below. The majority of conventionally grown fruits and vegetables test positive for not only insecticides, but also for hormone disrupting fungicides. And they use this to basically prevent mold and rotting. And these are gonna be found higher in fruits and vegetables that have to travel for longer periods of time and be stored at warehouses even before they're put on the shelf at the grocery store. So not only are they treating fruits and vegetables with insecticide and fungicide, but now they are spraying a peel on some of our fruits and vegetables just to give a better appearance of the fruits and vegetables and extend the shelf life in the grocery store. And if you don't know what APL is, you need to watch this video.